Living in LA, it can feel like everyone looks perfect, sometimes a little too perfect. But whatever you want, you can have it here. And today, Pixie and I want some new bathing suits. Pixie and I love to shop, and I took her to my friend Ashley Page's bikini boutique, and we went nuts. <gasps> Oh, this one's open cut out. Okay. I'm Let's do like it. Let's get naked. Like... This one doesn't fit my... Why can't Kat try that chocolate? I want to try the chocolate. That's what I want. Oh, that's cute. Man, I did get really this... small. Look how small my boobs got compared to your tig old bitties. You need to get some. Let's get you No, 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 don't. Yes, get boobs. It's pretty crazy standing next to Daisy because I think she has like a banging body and like it's just weird when you're standing next to somebody who's like the total bipolar opposite. I don't know, I'm just not into like cutting myself up, you know? Huh? And plus like there's so many dangers in the blue jobs. Did you ever have anything wrong with that? No, but that's why you go for a consultation. You go for a consultation and they tell you all that stuff. You're just listening to rumors. You don't like my boobs? I love your boobs. But I think everybody should have fake Why? boobs. Why? I, I love I think, fake boobs. I, I, I love it too. Listen, I just like the way they look. Everything in excess, I love that. But I like um, excessively small too. Oh my god, I really don't have any boobs. <laughs> Pixie thinks every woman should get breast implants. She's been selling me on the idea, but it's not something to take lightly. So I'm going for a consultation to see what it's all about. Hi. Hey, how are you? Good. What is your name? Uh, it should be under Bondi. Oh, okay. Cool. Great. Awesome. I'm going to take you back. Thank you. Here you go. I'll help you right with you. Thank you. You're welcome. After talking to Pixie about, you know, her boob job and stuff, it just kind of, like, made me start thinking about, um, you know, educating myself a little bit about the surgery and uh, what better place to go than Dr. Fisher. Hey. Hey, Kat. How are Dr. you? Dr. Fisher. How are you doing? Good, good to good. see you. I just pretty much just had to some, uh, I don't know, I guess. I don't really know much about plastic surgery or anything, but I just want to know if you could help me out. Um, I don't know, tell me about, like, getting a boob job. Well, let's talk about the good things. They certainly can enhance the shape of your breasts, make them look uh, fuller and, you know, perkier. I think the worst thing about breast implants, or the most common thing that you should worry about, is what's called capsular contracture, and that means getting a hard breast. And, it, and then, like, the healing process is pretty easy? It's not really that painful. I think you could probably be back at a desk job in five days. Oh, cool. Even if you, you feel like going back in one or two days. Listening to Dr. Fisher talk about, you know, the process and, like, you know, the things that might happen, whether they be good or bad, like, I don't know, I guess I'm not as scared as I was before, and it's kind of weird to hold, you know, those little things in your hand and they're all squishy and just to think like you're putting a foreign object in your body like it's it's way more extreme than getting tattooed that's for sure they're pretty durable yeah. you want me to show you what I do to most people I show this every day okay okay oh my god okay <laughs> when Dr. Fisher threw the silicone onto like the wall I was just like freaking out I thought I was gonna you know jump back and hit me in my face. The more information you have the better it's gonna exactly. be for you to make a, a good choice. Yeah that's that sounds cool it was Less scarier than I thought, so it's good. Okay. Thank you. Okay. I'll, I'll see you soon. You're welcome. I, I think we were pretty thorough with Kat, and I would say 40% of the people we see in this office we turn down for surgery. I, I think Kat's a good candidate for it, uh, and I, I would be happy to do the surgery. I'll okay. talk to you soon. All righty. My friend Gus is taking Pixie and me out to celebrate my big debut on the cover of his magazine. Okay. You ready? Yes, yes, yes. Oh my God, it's Ooh, so hot. hot. You did such a good job. Wow, that's bad. Thanks, dude, this looks so good. Did you uber hot. You're the first solo woman we've had on the cover, and the very first non-musician. Because oh, you're so yay. rock and roll. I love me, music is my life. It's so exactly. rad. Exactly, that's, that's the whole point. Dude, you made my boobs look huge. Yeah. <laughs> you know what, I think that they are huge. I think I'm just crazy. You totally don't no. need a boob job. Of course. I'm stupid. No, you're not. You don't need to change anything. <laughs> I've modified my body so much with all these tattoos. You know, even when I'm naked, I don't look naked. You know, I almost have a bodysuit. I have my face tattooed, you know, and like, I think that's enough. So I think I'll just stick to the tattoos.